Namaste. Welcome to Tridevi Chumundamandir in Denver, Colorado. I'm Yamajit. And first, I want to apologize for the quality of this video. Everything was set up with my laptop, and it started uh, updating. And so uh, right now, um, I'm about 13% through updates, yet it's time to begin the broadcast. So I'm recording this on my iPad uh, to download on YouTube when I'm done. So again, I apologize for that. So uh, welcome to part four of our series on tantric goddesses of the Trika tradition. And uh, tonight we'll be honoring uh, the, uh, the fourth goddess, really a combination of the previous three that we've discussed. That would be Pada in the middle, Pada Pada, the red goddess, and Apada, the dark goddess. So these represent three important functions of the divine, Icha Shakti, the power of will, Jnana Shakti, the power of knowledge, and Kriya Shakti, uh, the power of action. And so the fourth, and really the Trika is a tradition of three plus one, the fourth goddess, Kalas and Karshani Kali, is really a combination of all four, three of those powers. She's also known as Mahakali. And uh, this is an illustration I'm going to be referring to a lot in this presentation. So just taking a look at this, and I'm going to talk about some of her uh, symbolism, and then I'm going to refer to our altar. So she is naked, representing her connection with all things. The universe is literally her garb. She, uh, in the back, we see what appears to be a tongue of flame. And this can actually refer to two things. The tongue of flame can refer to the female genitalia, which we see very plainly on this goddess, uh, the yoni, and also the flame of the cremation ground. So, Mahakalas and Karshani Kali, or Mahakali, she's representing very much the forces that bring us into this world, but also the forces that call us home when our time has come. She is standing upon a peacock. And the peacock is associated with several Hindu deities, including Lord Brahma, who embodies the power of creation. And so, with the peacock under her feet, all of creation is subject to her shakti, to her powers, to the natural laws in which she embodies. And then below that, there's uh, the Kali Yantra. And this represents not just Kali in all of her aspects, but really the Divine Mother as well. So I'm going to bring up another Kali Yantra to talk about with this. So with the Kali Yantra, there's an inverted triangle. And this also is a, a yoni symbol. In the dot in the center, the bindu, is Ma, Maha Kali, or Kali in all of her aspects. Uh, Kalasankarshani Kali in that dot in the center. And then you see five concentric triangles. And these re uh, each of the points of those triangles, all together numbers 15, those are the 15 Kali Nitya goddesses. So the goddesses of the uh, waning lunar uh, nights. And uh, if you look back uh, on my channel, you'll see a full series on the Kali Nityas and what they represent and uh, what they govern. The uh, triangle is then surrounded by eight lotus petals 
and these represent the Ashtamatrika, the eight little mother goddesses, and there's also presentations for each of uh, them on this channel. And then the four-gated enclosure surrounding this figure, called a Bapura, in that are eight gods of the eight directions, known as the Dikpalas or Lokapalas. And uh, these are old Vedic deities, going back to the uh, Rig Veda, which was written uh, down about uh, 3,500 years ago. So, very powerful symbol in that Kali Yantra. So, referring back to our illustration, She's wearing a crown of five skulls. She has two malas, uh, prayer necklaces, around her neck. And she's gazing at her own reflection in a mirror. She is also uh, leading with her uh, right leg, which is uh, extended, and that's the direction that she's facing. And this is the dakshina, orientation or the benevolent orientation. So this is showing that the goddess in this form is a benevolent uh, giving uh, form of the Divine Mother. So I'm going to pan the camera now down to our altar. get that into focus and so you can watch the puja and take part in the meditation that we're going to do. We're going to do a little mini fire puja with um, a small um, copper brazier with um, uh, charcoal in it to act as our fire. So I first want to refer to the mirror that you saw in this image. And there's a lot of Hindu temples in Nepal that I've been to that have a mirror at the entrance. So it's this idea of knowing yourself as you embark upon a spiritual path. And another item of importance in this is the Divine Mother is looking at her own reflection and really, this explains the nature of the universe. The universe itself is her reflection, being reflected in the infinite darkness of space. So we are all part of that reflection. All things are part of that reflection. Like this Mahakali image from Kathmandu, She's bearing a crown of five skulls. And this represents the transformation of five poisons. And those five poisons are anger, desire, ignorance, jealousy, and pride. And they're being converted into five wisdoms. And those wisdoms are the wisdom of Dharma, the wisdom of divine purpose, mirror-like wisdom, there's that mirror again, self-knowledge, wisdom of equality, wisdom of discernment, and all-accomplishing wisdom. That is, wisdom of what is good for oneself, but also for everyone around us. So I mentioned uh, the... Uh, Crown, the mirror, the Kaliantra, the peacock. In our altar here, I have a small stone with a natural cleft in it to represent the yoni. So, this is the ultimate symbol of creation. And then the mala, or prayer necklace the power of mantra, and the vibrations that drive the universe.
So Ma Kala Sankarshani is the embodiment of really all aspects of the Divine Mother. And she represents in our own spiritual development where we as a reflection of Mother Divine, we are working so closely with her powers, with her existence, that in our day-to-day -day existence we're functioning really as her instrument upon this earth, really in a co-creative role. So Jema Kalasankarshini Kali. By the way, her name means the pow great power of time, or depending on how you translate it, the great power of darkness that transmits wisdom. So again, she's a great giver of wisdom. I'm going to make one final preparation for our puja. And then we'll go ahead and get started. And as always, if there are questions, feel free to message me at my channel or email me at so my temple email, om, A-U-M, C, Davy, D-E-V-I at gmail.com again om c davy at gmail.com so to begin our devotion to this form of the divine mother i invite you to find a comfortable place to sit place where you can sit with a straight back. If you need some kind of straight support behind your back, you can even sit in a straight back chair or against a wall. And I invite you now to close your eyes and breathe deeply. Just taking a moment prepare for the work that we're about to do. And there's not an official mantra to this form of the goddess that I found in the Trika literature. So one that I'm going to use really reflects this form of the Divine Mother in all of her aspects. It's going to be Om, Rim, Srim, Krim, Adhikalika, Paramishvara, Svaha. So Om, Rim, Srim, Krim, Adhikalika, Paramishvara, Spa, and I'll explain some things about that following the puja. And as you're comfortable with it, you're welcome when we get to the mantra to uh, chant along, or you can just meditate quietly and let the vibrations of the mantra take your consciousness to where it needs to be. But breathing deeply and focusing on your heart center. I invite you at this time to think about some small aspect of your life that is ready for transformation, ready for healing, maybe something in your life where you need guidance. And just take a moment and ask the Divine Mother for her support and for her guidance and for her assistance.
And then I invite you to slowly bring the palms of your hands together at your heart center. And we'll open our practice by chanting a, a mantra that is part of the trika, that really embodies the Divine Mother in all of her aspects. And that's the syllable hrim, H-R-I-M. And we're gonna chant that three times. Inhale. Exhale, slowly opening your eyes. Om. Pavitra, Pavitrova, Sarvavastam Gatopiva, Yashmade. Pandari Kaksham Sabya Bianta Sushi Om Om Gam Ganapataye Namo Nama Jaganesha Om Sri Guru Bio Nama Jaguru Om Namah Shivaya. Om Namah Shivaya. Om Jayanti Mangala Kali Badra Kali Kapalini. Durga Shama Shivadatri Svasvada Namostute. Jayat Vam Devi Chumunde. Jaya Bhuti Taharani. Jaya Sarvagati Devi Kalaratri Namostute. Jema Kali. Om. Om Rim Srim Krim. Ajikali Kapali Mishvada Om Rim Srim Krim Ajikali Kapali Mishvada Om Rim Srim Krim Ajikali Kapali Mishvada Om Rim Srim Krim Ajikalika Padamishvara Sva 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 Jema Devi Prapanote Hare Prasida Prasida Matara Jagata Kilasya 
Vasida Bishvesvara Pe Vishvam Tvami Shura Devi Chachara Charasya Agni Jotir Jati Agnir Sva Agni Jotir Jati Agnir Sva Agni Jotir Jati Agnir Sva I invite you to make yourself comfortable. Close your eyes. And I'll be repeating our mantra while I make offerings of herbs and fragrant woods to our fire. You can chant along if you feel comfortable or just meditate on the sound of the mantra. Om Rim Srim Krim Ajikalika Padmishvara Sva 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 Om Rim Srim Krim Ajikalika Padamishvara 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 Sva 
Om Rim Srim Krim Ajikalika Paramishvarasva. 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 Om Rim Srim Krim Ajikalika Paramishvara. Sva. Breathe deeply. Feeling the power of the mantra. Feel it entering you, transforming you, healing you. Allow it to guide you in the days ahead. And know that Mahakali, Mahakala Sankarshani Kali, know that she is always with you, both within and without. And just know that she can be called upon whenever you have need. Jema. 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 And then take a deep and clearing breath, letting go of the meditation, becoming aware of your surroundings again. Bringing the palms of your hands together at your heart center. Slowly opening your eyes. And Namaste. And Jai Mata Di. So the meaning of our mantra is to the primordial feminine principle of creation, preservation, and destruction. That would be Hrim, Srim, Hrim. Who cuts off all illusion to those who are not sheltered from the light of existence. That would be Parameshvari. Adyakalika means the primordial Kali or the ancient Kali. And Svaha is sometimes translated to mean I am one with the divine. So to the primordial feminine principle of creation, preservation and destruction, the ancient Kali who cuts off all illusion to those who are not sheltered from the, from the light of existence. Jema. So before we close, I'd like to um, make a couple of announcements. 
So this coming Friday uh, at 7 o'clock will um, be our monthly uh, Kriya Yoga Puja and uh, Satsang. Um, we'll be uh, doing another, the second of what I call the ecstatic processes, and that is um, using Kriya practices for, um, for just really powerful releases of blocked energy, blocked emotions, just kind of a wonderful exercise and pushing our personal reset button, <laughs> maybe doing a little um, energetic closet cleaning. And then we're going to continue uh, in the Trika series um, for the next, uh, at least the next three or four weeks. And I'm going to share some practices from uh, probably the most accessible of the Trika scriptures, the Vignan Bhairava Tantra. And I'll be sharing some of the meditational practices from that, including, and we'll include that with a short puja as well. Um, for those of you who are regulars uh, with the temple, I've sent out our monthly calendar for uh, December. If anybody would like to um, uh, be included on our mailing list, please um, uh, message me at my YouTube channel or again, uh, drop me an email at uh, om, A-U-M, C, Davy, D-E-V-I, at gmail.com. So thank you very much for uh, joining me this evening. Again, sorry for the uh, technical problems. But I look forward to seeing you next time. And Friday, we should definitely have a working laptop. So, Namaste. Jai Mata Di. Blessings always. And have a wonderful night. Jai Ma.